proceed. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, uh, members of the committee, uh, Representative Stephen Weber from Boone County here with House Bill 1500. Uh, first, let me, I want to thank the chairman um, for, for allowing this hearing to happen, and I, I'm genuinely excited to have House Bill 1500 in front of this committee. Uh, this is a bill that I've, I've carried for the last three years, and uh, looking at this committee, I, I believe that the folks who do a lot of the heavy lifting on the House floor in this committee, and I believe this bill is going to pass, uh, the members of the Judiciary Committee are folks that are going to have to uh, decide if this bill is a priority for them, decide this is the right thing to do and get on board. So I appreciate the opportunity to present it to you today. Mr. Chairman, uh, House Bill 1500, this is an issue um, that has been very important to me in the last few years and I've worked very hard for. And a lot of the reason uh, that I have is that I believe that this bill brings us closer to the type of society uh, where Americans are judged, in the words of Dr. Martin Luther King, by the content of their character. Uh, and that's what this bill uh, today is about. Most Americans and Missourians are stunned to find out that today in the 21st century, uh, a worker who has been competently doing their job uh, can be fired for being simply being gay. Uh, that a person can be denied the ability to rent a home or purchase a home in a neighborhood. Uh, that public accommodations, uh, such as access to a restaurant, can be denied even on the perception, or the misconceived perception of being gay. And there is absolutely zero state or federal protections that those discriminated individuals can take advantage of to protect them. There is absolutely no help whatsoever from the state. And most, most Missourians I mean, most Americans are, are, are surprised to learn that, and the majority of them don't think that's right. So my bill, uh, House Bill 1500, uh, attempts to remedy that situation. Uh, what it does is it works through uh, the current equal protection laws, which I think many of us are familiar with due to uh, several floor debates on those over the last couple of years. Uh, and it, it adds, it simply adds another protected class. It adds, adds uh, sexual orientation and gender identity as a class of individuals or as a reason that you cannot discriminate in the state of Missouri. You have to judge folks on the merits uh, just as you would judge anybody else. Um, I'm, I'm happy to take any questions, and I do have some witnesses lined up. Thank you. 